And thank you for joining us on TVC News at 5. We begin this hour in Plateau State, where troops have arrested three persons suspected to have masterminded the abduction and killing of a community leader in the southern part of Kaduna State. Phnom Joshua has details. The latest suspects are alleged to have been terrorizing communities in southern Kaduna and Plateau State in recent times. The leadership of Operation Safe Heaven mandated to restore normalcy across crisis communities in Plato State and the southern Kaduna area of Kaduna State has recorded another success. These three suspects are believed to have masterminded the abduction and the eventual killing of the leader of a Fulani community in the Ikulu community of Zongon Katav Council area of Kaduna State. A two million naira ransom was paid to the kidnappers, but they later killed the community leader. Another group of suspects paraded where two brothers accused of killing their biological father in an attempt to inherit his world. The killers of a retired military officer in a community in Zangonkata Council area of Kaduna State were also paraded. The command also raided a railway vandal's hideout and recovered vandalized railway sleepers and other stolen items. The late Ado was ambushed while on transit and moved to Nguazomo where he was killed. Preliminary investigation also revealed that the late Ado was murdered even after a ransom of 2 million naira was paid due to his own biased stance and insistence on peaceful coexistence in the Zango Katab Janara area. The arrested suspect will be charged to court for prosecution immediately investigations are concluded. Similarly, a retired personnel of the Nigerian Air Force, Master Warrant Officer Hamza Musa, was murdered in his residence at Gusenbako village under Ikulu Chidong in Zango Kataf, local government area of Kaduna State, by his two sons. On the 6th of March 2024, personnel were able to capture the shooter of Mr. Istifanus, 55 years in Bokos. His actions also inflicted gunshot injuries on Mr. Irmia David, 45 years old, at Cop Village in Bokos local government area of Plateau State. The leadership of the Operation Safe Heaven assured that sponsors of criminal activities, perpetrators and mischief makers in Operation Safe Heaven areas of mission will be arrested and face the wrath of the law. 